starting with our basic green smoothie recipe, we are going to add berries into the mix before adding the liquid. So this is our berry yummy, berry green <laughs> smoothie bowl. So I'm just adding maybe a cup or three quarts cup of berries. I chose strawberries and blueberries and like our banana. It has to be frozen. Oh, I almost forgot our malungay. And what I really like adding to this recipe is adding a little bit of like super food punch to it other than what I already put, which is the malungay. And that is by adding Mega Mangosteen. So this is really good. My husband loves this. It's good for the circulatory system. I just add one or two of these depending if I'm having it as well because um, this is better for those who have already given birth, not for pregnant moms. So if I know I'm going to have a little sip, maybe I'll just put one. But um, this is best recommended for those who are already um, breastfeeding or for dads or for lolas. There you go. So I put my mega mangosteen, my berries, my basic recipe in there. And then instead of coconut water, we are going to add guava nectar juice. And I'm going to add dragon fruit, super high in vitamin C. And this one lends a beautiful shade of purple. Just in case you want your smoothie to be easier to drink and um, to be used for both a smoothie bowl and a regular like smoothie in a cup, you might want to add more liquid in it. Since we have a lot, um, we have enough to make a smoothie bowl and a little cup for those who are impatient and want to have a taste of your smoothie as soon as possible. So that would be my two kids. For the rest, we are going to make a mini smoothie bowl. Mm. Oh, so good. Mm. Okay, we have to I have to garnish this before I before I finish everything. So for this we used strawberries, like tons of berries. Make sure to cut it not too thick because it might sink. And we could add some of the dragon fruit that we added on top as well. I also like adding cranberries in this. Mega Malungai on top just to make it really pretty. And maybe just a dash of these nice flax seeds that are full of omega-3. Mmm. So good. So good. You do have to try this. There's the crunch. Mm. So much berries in there. You don't even taste any of the greens. This is why you have to add this in your children's diet. Because they don't know that you're actually giving them half a cup of veggies. In fact, you gave them more than a cup of veggies because putting that mega malungai powder alone gives them a half to three fourths cup of, of malungai in the diet and all those veggies that are masked with the yumminess of the berries it's just fantastic a surefire way to make sure that your kids get enough veggies every day so good Look who joined us! Say hello! This is my youngest. And she's the one who loves the berry smoothie, but not in the bowl form. She likes it in the usual berry smoothie form. You want some sip? Want to sip? 